Hello everyone, welcome to Success Education. In this video, we will see the solution for science journal for standard 7. Experiment number 9, the aim is to show that water is present as moisture in the soil. The apparatus and materials are hard glass test tube, burner and stand and the substances to be used are soil sample. Before that, if you have not subscribed my channel till now, please do subscribe it for more videos. And you need to draw the same figure on the right hand side where the space is given. And the procedure is, take a hard glass test tube, put two spoonful of a soil sample in it, heat it on a flame. After some time, observe the upper part of the hard glass test tube. And the observation is, water drops are seen on the upper part of the test tube. And the conclusion is, on heating water in the soil evaporates moves up and condenses on the cooler inner wall of the upper part of the boiling tube that means soil has water in the form of moisture now test your knowledge question number one is ncqs first one which horizon of soil has a lesser amount of humus but more of minerals it's option number c b horizon second in which type of soil does particles water can uh, drain quickly it's option number C, sandy soil. Third, which type of soil is used to make pots, toys and statues? It's option number B, silty soil. Fourth, which type of soil is suitable for crops like wheat and gram? It's option number D, silty and loamy. Fifth, which type of soil has the highest water holding capacity? It's option number C, silty soil. Now question number two that is true or false. First one. Loamy soil is the best for the growth of plant, it is true. Second, sandy soil is made of sand, clay and silt, it is false. Third, marsh is seen in sandy soil, it is false. Now question number three that is answer the following questions in one sentence. First one, what is humus? Humus is the rotting dead matter in the soil. Second, state the components of soil composition. The components of soil composition are gravels, sand, clay and humus. Third one, what is soil erosion? The removal of land surface by flowing water or wind is called soil erosion. And here we come to the end of experiment number 9. I hope you have understood the complete experiment. If you have any doubts, you can write in the comments section. I'll surely try to answer all the questions. Thank you for watching my video and do subscribe my channel for more updates. Thank you.